A Zhanghua woman recently received a surprise in the mail from Pingdong Prison. Ten inmates sent an envelope filled with money orders to help cover her son's medical bills. Her son was the victim in a high-profile case of workplace abuse in 2020. When the inmates learned of his ordeal, they decided to pool their prison earnings, coming up with 16,000 NT to help. Ten money orders in denominations from 1,000 to 3,000 NT for a total sum of 16,000 NT. A woman received them by registered mail at her home in Zhanghua County. She was at a loss at first. After examining the mail closely, she found a handwritten letter from 10 inmates at Pingdong Prison. They had pulled their prison earnings to express their care and concern for her family. The woman could barely hold back tears as she read their words. They wanted to show they cared about what happened to my son. It feels very good that they care about us so much. I'm very grateful for their kindness. Two years ago, her young son had gone to Taoyuan to work at a steel company, where he was severely abused by his bosses. At the end of his ordeal, he had lost several of his toes, and he suffers from post-traumatic stress disorder to this day. The 10 inmates at Pingdong Prison heard of what happened to the teen. They decided to donate their wages from factory work to help the son and his mother. They feel that they need to give back what they got from society to make a contribution. So over these past three years, they have been quietly engaged in acts of kindness. It's a way to show that they're determined to reform. The Jianghua woman runs a food stall to support her family and pay her son's medical expenses. She says the donation comes at a time of need and that she's grateful for the kindness. Since the inmates began donating their wages three years ago, they have given more than 300,000 NT to others. Although they all committed crimes that have put them in prison, they're keen to give back to society and chart a new path forward.